it's come to that time that I feel like digging the potatoes because they're definitely ready and um, I kind of want to try them. Literally these ones that I planted, I wasn't physically able to dig the ground due to health reasons. Now, what I'd done was I literally sort of pushed them in a little bit and threw some, um, what do you call it? Pea straw over the top. So literally these potatoes, as you can see, are basically grown on top of the ground. And I'm just gonna put it out there. They're, they're gonna be sun damaged, so they're gonna be green. Or some of them are, not all of them. But, fucking hell, like that's a, I'm sorry, but that is, what the? That is a decent sized spud. Um, wow. Considering that's literally grown on top of the ground. Fuck me. Get that in here. Right, so that's the first one. Fuck, they're, they're literally just all, I don't have to get on my hands and knees. I'm just gonna have to get down on my hands and knees. So let's go for a look. Righty -o. So yeah, that's damaged by the sun. That's green there. So I will sort of these out later, but Have a look, like literally, it's literally, literally just under the pea straw. Look at them all. Like, look at that. Straight, that's actually broken off another. I am very impressed. Like, no effort whatsoever. Okay, it's got a bit of a bug in it. Um, wow. This is a little baby. We might as well leave that in there and it can grow again next year. Or this season, next season, not next year, this will be this year. But, another bug. Um, seriously, beautiful Dutch creams. So these are literally starting to grow in the kitchen cupboard when I planted these. Um, but look at them now. Wow. And like I said, zero effort. Literally thrown on top of the ground and left to their own devices. Um, Look at that big cluster. Look at it. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, look at that. I'm not sure what that is, but Mr. Potato and Mrs. Potato done something funny. Um, yeah, interesting. Just, I'm still blown away, just saying. Um, what have we got here? Well, I guess this is going to keep me busy. Hmm. Literally, one potato plant. One potato plant. The potato was literally pushed maybe that far into the dirt and pea straw over the top. And dead set. I reckon I've got nearly 10 kilos of potatoes from one one plant. Um, so that's literally the, the potato head from the one plant. Um, you can see the main root there. That's just the one plant. That's the space it was in, which is probably, I don't know, between 40 and 50 centimetres square. Obviously there's another plant right next to it and another one's there. And also found out that that's actually a butternut pumpkin plant that I've planted there, which I couldn't remember what it was. But here it is. This is all of the potatoes from just one, just one plant. Look at them. Like, well, that's a bit different. <laughs> but to see that size, um, obviously there's a lot of little ones too. I am seriously impressed. Um, so what have we got? I've got probably, there's probably about six to eight meters of just potato plants and they're not the full width. They're only actually literally two rows of them. I could have done four. Um, yeah, very, very impressed with that hole from one. Did I say that yet? One potato plant. <laughs> Fucking winning.